Hey guys, welcome back to Allie Can Cook featuring Mama McManus. Hi, I'm Mama McManus. And I'm Allie. And on today's episode of Allie Can Cook, we are going to be showing you guys how we make our cauliflower bites. So these cauliflower bites are super simple to make, require barely any ingredients, and you can mix them up however way you want with the different sauces. They're kind of a combination between just eating cauliflower on its own and like the amount of effort it takes to pick the cauliflower wings. So these are a great alternative if you're looking for a fast and easy healthy snack. Much better than grabbing potato chips. Yes. And a lot of you might remember having cauliflower served to you with your grandmother's heavy cheddar cheese sauce and that would be extremely unhealthy. So this, we're going to show you how to make it with some really interesting sauces. Mm -hmm. And fun. yeah, it's definitely very versatile and super simple to make. So if you want to see how we make our cauliflower bites, keep watching. bites in the oven at 425 for 10 minutes and then after 10 minutes you're going to take them out flip them and then put them back in for another 10 minutes but that is just a rough guideline make sure you watch the right. bites because yes. everyone's oven's different and this one in particular at the farm burns things yes. so you have to be very very careful so it might not be that long yeah but that's just like guidelines so just keep watching them if you find that they're getting pretty crispy you might want to take them out flip them and do the other side and just keep an eye on them. But you do want to get them to their, to their crisp. Yeah, the crispier the better. Right, but not burnt. really simple cauliflower bites. This is a great snack to eliminate the potato chips or the candy or whatever else yeah. you usually grab. Absolutely and again we're on a farm so we're not close to the variety store where we did get a craving for potato chips. Can't yeah. run out for them. But cauliflower is a great alternative, super healthy and as well we put barbecue sauce mm -hmm. on it Yeah. but you can do any sauce you want. So mom you... you well yeah that. so you could do olive oil, salt and pepper, you can do barbecue sauce if you wanted to, hot sauce, hot sauce, whatever you feel or like. Actually, just plain with salt and pepper. Once you roast them in the oven, they have a sweetness to them, so that's quite nice. Yeah, and they're crispy. But yeah, so we're gonna dig into yep. these now. Mmm. Mm. Oh, that has a little bit of heat to it. Mm -hmm. That's the other thing. Paprika would be another. Yeah, you can put other spices or salt on it. It's really whatever you want. Just mm -hmm. the technique of. Baking them in the oven for 425, dressing them with whatever you want. It's a really nice snack and also good for appetizers. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Maybe a little side dip of um, something. Ranch. There's vegan ranch recipes out there. Well, there you go. We'll find some vegan ranch recipes mm -hmm. for you and mm -hmm. make up some side dips. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe. We make new videos every single Thursday. 
and we will see you guys next week. Bye. Bye, guys. Okay, you're a nut. I sh 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 sh